welcome back to my channel uh, before we do the unboxing um, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and I'm gonna be unboxing one of my wish list items that I've been wanting for I would say almost like a year um, so I did get it on fashion file um, because I wanted the old version of the Nano Speedy, not the new one. So I decided to go with um, used. So the packaging is like this. Um, I did open it before, but it comes with like little confetti that it's like on the very bottom. And then. Just take it out of the box. So then as you can see, it does come with the confetti and then it gives you the little uh, fashion file. This is my first purchase from fashion file. I had never shopped in fashion file. I only shopped in rebag and I was pretty um, good with the purchase. So I'm gonna put this big box aside. Um, however, I did get a little, um, kind of like worried because I wasn't here when they delivered it and it is signature required and I was like a little skeptical, like why didn't they just, I don't know, um, they just left it outside. So I was kind of like a little bit scary. It just comes with a little sticker. Um, I was able to get it with the box and dust bag, which I'm very fortunate. Um, based on the ones that I saw in Fashion File, they did not come with the box or dust bag. So I did, I do have like the new alert um, kind of like thing that you can do on Fashion File whenever a new item is posted based on what you want. Um, and then they tell you if it's available or not so I did have this um, on my new alert and I had seen it and there's been like three times I swear no like yeah I'm gonna say like three to four times that I'm about to purchase and then I keep doubting like no it's not it's not good enough or I'll just wait until it gets reduced or something like that and then they ended up winning the bag so um I remember there was one that was 1700 and it was brand new and I don't know why I doubted to get it <laughs> and I didn't get it so I missed that opportunity so this one I was a little skeptical about it and I was scared that I wasn't gonna like it because um I had this one on my wish list like the favorite ones and then it sold out and then it came back in stock, which means that they either returned it or they, I guess, like, you can put it on reserve and you don't pay. So it goes back in, in the in the listing. So I think it was two weeks. Um, so I'm assuming that it did get returned. So I was a little scared. Um, so it does come with a box. So I'm so excited. This is my second uh, luxury bag. My first one was the actual speedy 25 bandolier so it does come with um, an own fashion file dust bag which i'm pretty happy it's pretty big i'm pretty amazed and then it is the drawstring which i think it's very very cool i do think i'm gonna fit my hopefully it fits my speedy 25 because the dust bag that it comes with is too small for it um, to fit, um, like, opened up. Because you know how to, they put it, um, kind of, like, folded in the, in the box. So I'm not able to fit it, um, like, actually fold apart. So hopefully that fits. Um, but it does come with a dust bag. This one did. And I did already opened it before because I just wanted to verify that I did like it. That it wasn't going to be um, kind of like something that I would have to return. So this is it. I can't believe I have it in my hands. 
It's the Nano Speedy with the old version, the non-detachable strap, and then the longer, the longer thing, the longer length. Um, cause I knew the new one is, um, kind of like longer and it did claim it had, um, I don't know how to pronounce it. Uh, I don't know if it's pilling or piling, but it claimed that inside it had like, um, you're not going to be able to see it's too dark, but it claimed that it had like little bolts, like little lens balls. I don't know how to say it. Like when you have um like a shirt and you rub it too much like for example with the with my jeans in between my thighs it creates like little um bubbles or like little lint i don't know how to say it but it claimed that i had that inside and it honestly is perfect inside it was made in france which i'm so excited about I'm not sure if you can see it. And then it was, according to the, it was made in the 32nd week of 2020. So this is around two years old, um, but I actually love it. Um, the patina of the Vachetta, I'm not actually sure. Let me see if I can get my... Um, the only patina, like, the only pochetta that I have is the, the mini pochette. So this one, I got it pretty new. It's from February, uh, of this year. Um, so this is the patina of this pochetta. So I'm going to compare it to the one over here. Let me test. Wow. It's actually, I don't know why this one looks darker. That's so scary. This one looks way darker, even though this one's newer than this one. So, wow. Um, it barely has patina. Um, it does have a little, a few marks um, right here. I don't know if you can focus, please. It has a little marks here and there, but overall, it's perfect. I can't find anything wrong with it. So, um, I'm thinking they may probably returned it because it was too small for them. Or the strap. The strap has a little bit of creases on it, but honestly, that's going to happen regardless. Because of wear and tear. Um, so, before I wear this out, it has been raining where I live so I'm a little bit scared of actually getting watermarks so before that happens um, I'm gonna treat it with Apple Guard so I am gonna treat it with Apple Guard first um, and honestly it looks perfect and then this is the authenticity thing um, and then if you want to return it, um, it has to be, um, still here. So it's actually perfect. Um, I'm so in love with it. Um, it's been one of my all time wish list items. And I'm really sad that I didn't, honestly, I didn't think about getting it until it got discontinued and then when I wanted it it got discontinued so I was like well that's great and I thought that they were going to keep the same design with just detachable straps um but it didn't it changed completely and then the zipper has no scratches which I'm pretty amazed by the length on me fits perfect I am five feet and it just, um, I feel like my torso is longer than my legs. So I feel like it fits me perfectly. It fits me right at my hip and I'm five, um, I'm five feet tall. So then, yeah, it's so pretty. I'm so in love with it, you guys. I honestly am not going to return it. Um, 
So yeah, my husband laughed a little bit when he saw the size of this thing, but I am not ashamed. Um, so let me see what fits inside of it because I'm honestly haven't tried out anything. So I'm pretty sure that this is not going to fit, which I'm, I don't think of fitting this. I think someone did fit inside of it. Um, and it did go inside, but very, very snug. And I do not want that. So I'm thinking of putting my key. Let me just zoom in a little bit so you guys can see. I'm going to put my keys. Um, let's see, my glasses. Let's see if that fits. Um, my wallet. And that's pretty much all I fit inside. And then my coin purse. Let's see if all this fits inside. So first I'm gonna put my wallet. That's the most essential thing. And it fits perfectly. And then my keys. Okay. And then I don't have my phone right now because it's charging. Um, but hopefully it does fit. I think I've seen videos when it fits um, let me put the, my Ray-Bans first. Um, I think that gets a little bit snug. I don't want to break them. Let me see if I can, if I put them first. Let me see if that fits. Wow. So you are able to snug. They fit a little bit snug, but they fit, guys. They fit. Um, my wallet. And wow. Wow, wow, wow. Honestly, I don't think I'm going to put my phone inside of here, but it fit all of that inside. Um, now, if you're going to be taking off things, maybe it could be a little bit hard. Um, the hardest thing to fit inside was indeed the glasses. But. That's pretty cool. I mean, yeah, it's a little bit snug, but you're able to get in and out. I think if I didn't have my key fob and just like the key um, holder, it would be easier. But I mean, it fits. It fits. I'm so impressed of how much this fits. But honestly, my glasses, eh, I don't think I would be fitting these inside. But they do fit, you guys, and it looks almost the same size. I think what helps is that here it has a little bit of um, space, so you're able to push it out. But I don't want to actually force it. So that's everything that fits inside. Well, that I want to fit inside. Let me see if the mini pochette by itself. Um, it's pretty packed. Um, with lipsticks, um, drops, um, cream, well, lotion. I don't know why I say cream. Uh, let me see. Oh, wow. So it did fit my mini pochette, my wallet, and then... I would of course need my keys. Let me see. Okay, I don't know how to fit my keys inside here. No, we have a problem. Okay, well it kind of fits on the very top. So that's, uh, let me see if it fits. Uh, I don't think it's gonna fit. Okay, it fits, but it's too snug together. So that's my wallet, my Victorian wallet, um, my mini pochette, and my key holder, which I'm pretty impressed. I'm, I wasn't sure it was going to fit my mini pochette, um, but I don't think I'm going to be fitting my mini pochette. That's too big, honestly. Um, so, wow. I'm pretty happy with the purchase. 
and I'm for sure gonna keep it. I'm gonna I'm not gonna wear it until I have my apple guard on it just because I don't want to mess it up. The bachetta looks really intact. Um, so yeah, um, I, I hope you like this video. I hope you um, liked this bag as much as I do. And comment below if you prefer this version or the, the new one. I prefer this one, I don't know. It, it looks much more aesthetically pleasing. The other one, just, I don't know. Something about it does not just not amuse me. I think it's the thickness of the strap on the new one that's too thick. Um, but yeah. Oh, and then I think, hold on. So my mom actually, well, I do have um, a bag with all my little kid bags and I found this bag and I think this one is the reason why I'm getting this one. Um, my Nano Speedy. Um, so ever since I was little, I love collecting bags. I love handbags. So I think this is why I'm getting the Nano Speedy. And I feel like my 10-year-old self would be so proud of me. And this is the reason um, I found this bag, which is kind of like looks... Well, it's kind of like a small Speedy. Of course, this is from Justice. But... It's honestly like identical. Honestly, if I'm not sure if they have, I think they do have the multicolor in the Yano Speedy. Um, of course, it's really hard to get. I think I've seen it. I'm not sure if it's real or fake, but I think it does exist. I've seen it in black and white multicolor, but this is the reason I feel like I'm getting the Nano Speedy. This was in my favorite type of bag, and it also is why I'm getting, I got the Speedy 25. So isn't this just so cute? It's like a little Speedy, of course, from Justice when I was little. But it is rather bigger than the Nano Speedy. This one can fit way more... I feel like this, um, actually I've never seen a Speedy 20, but I think that this is the size of a Speedy 20. Um, I've never seen it in person, I don't have a boutique, so I'm thinking that this is a size 20. This would be a size 20 and then this is now Speedy, but I feel like this one is the reason why I love handbags, these type of handbags since I was little, and it's just like so amusing to see that this is like my 10 year old love converting to a grown woman <laughs> um so i'm just so happy with my purchase um please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and as you can see based on my other video i was finally able to put my keys <laughs> um i don't like the rings that i have but i'm gonna just deal with it um, and then I do have to take this off regularly, so that's why I have this clip. So, so far so good with the, the key pouch, um, not key pouch, the six ring key holder. I really love it. Um, the only thing that really bugs me is that it's starting to lift. But I mean, that's just wear and tear. So, what else was I going to say about the Nano Speedy? I think I covered everything that I wanted to say. Um, so, yeah. Please like this video, subscribe, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.